Hello everyone, today we'll be looking at the cosine rule. What we'll be looking at in this video, what the cosine rule is, how to substitute in values into the cosine rule, example questions and exam questions. So what is the cosine rule? The cosine rule can only be applied with non right angle triangles and the cosine rule also has to do with trigonometry so the formula of the cosine rule is a squared equals b squared plus c squared minus 2bc cos a the small a is the missing side of the triangle b and c are the sides that are usually given in a question and the capital a is the angle that are between sides b and c So how to substitute in values into the formula. So the question will usually be find the missing length. So here's the triangle. Here's the angle which is 65 degrees. And then one side will be 9.5 meters. The other side is 17.4 meters. And then you have the missing length. So first you would state your formula. You always get a mark for stating your formula which is a squared equals b squared plus c squared minus 2bc cos a then you substitute in values so a squared will equal to 9.5 squared plus 17.4 squared minus 2 times 9.5 times 17.4 times cos 65 when you have b squared and c squared and then minus 2bc usually put the smaller number as b and the bigger number as c but it doesn't really matter which way because it will still get the right answer and then from there you continue to working out now we're going to look at an example question the question is find the missing length this is the usual question that you'll get for the cosine rule and you'll give your answer to three significant figures here's the triangle the angle is 43 degrees one side is 6.2 meters the other side is 5.3 meters and you need to find the missing side first you state your formula which is a squared equals b squared plus c squared minus 2bc cos a then you substitute in the values so you will get a squared equals 5.3 squared plus 6.2 squared minus 2 times 5.3 times 6.2 times cos 43. So a squared is equal to 18.46543473. Then you would square root the answer. So a equals square root of 18.4 six five four three four seven three so the answer is four point two nine seven one four two six two four but obviously the question wants it to three significant figures so the missing side is four point three zero meters now we're going to look at an exam question work out the size of the angle ABC. Sometimes you have to uh, rearrange the cosine rule. Instead of finding the missing side, now you have to look for the missing angle. And give your degree to three significant figures. So here's the triangle. So you sides A, B, C. And here are the sides. So you're looking for so you're looking for the angle which is here so a a is one length c is the other length and the intercept is b so this is the angle here so you first state your formula which is a squared equals b squared plus c squared minus 2bc cos a and then you rearrange the formula so you can get the angle so you'll rearrange to cos a equals 
b squared plus c squared minus a squared over 2bc. Next you substitute in values and you'll get cos a equals 5 squared plus 9 squared minus 10 squared divided by 2 times 9 times 5. How you would know what a squared is in this question is the side that is opposite to the angle you're looking for. And the side opposite to the angle we're looking for is the side of 10 centimeters. After you substitute in your values, you put the fraction into the inverse function. So cos, so cos A would be equal to 6 over 90 after you, you simplified the fraction. Then you put it to cos to the minus 1, 6 over 90. And you will get 86.17744627. And then the question wants it to three significant figures. So the size of the angle ABC is 86.2 degrees. I hope you found this video useful. Please click on the subscribe and bell buttons for more content from this channel and please feel free to share. Thank you for watching.